guys, I just got my hair done. I don't know if you can tell, but she is back. my first time in the Apple store in Singapore, like the dome type one. Hello. Oh, what the? I look so wide in that. Look at how wide we look. Guys, I have AirPods in because I'm testing them out. Oh my gosh, guys, you know how I've been avoiding packing? It's just not my cup of tea, but I, I'm gonna start. I keep saying that, I'm so annoying, but I'm gonna start. You know what I found? I decided to seek some help for packing and I went online and I looked for like a packing list generator so now that's what I'm using to help aid me with my packing list because I'm just so overwhelmed with what I need to bring not need to bring what if I forget something there's this one time I went to Australia like a really, really long time ago and I packed everything besides my undergarments and I left my undergarments bag at home and then I reached Australia and I was like I brought everything everything besides my undergarments and that was just absolutely terrible i don't want to repeat that mistake packing is super overwhelming but this packing generator thing is kind of helping me i like stringing my thoughts in a straight line rather than it being all like curvy everywhere in my head you know it's like jumbled up so yeah that's that um just wanted to update you on the generator it's kind of helpful and um, if you also have a hard time packing just like google and packing lists like templates they'll tell you what you should take um again it's not 100 percent helpful but it's something also now that the dates are coming closer and closer to me leaving i'm getting really nervous but like i'm really excited but at the same time nervous and it's like a weird feeling because usually when you're traveling it's always been like oh my god i'm so excited my flight is soon but now i'm like oh my god i'm my flight is soon i don't know what it is this whole overwhelming process of not traveling or doing really anything for the past two and a half years or two years um it's been i don't know like and as i said like my anxiety and stuff has also become worse i think i don't know it's just i don't know you know i don't know like i'm really excited but i'm also kind of nervous but i'm also like this is something that's really necessary for me and my personal growth and i think once i've started my journey and when i'm like in the flight itself i know that i will be able to adapt with all the circumstances and stuff right now i'm just like really overthinking everything which is just not the best place to be in but i have to also honor my thoughts and let them pass um and so i'm kind of doing that but i just wanted to kind of share how i'm feeling like i would honestly i would always think that wow i'm so excited to go which i really am but i'm also really nervous it's been a while since i've gone anywhere i gotta rely on myself <laughs> which is fine but it's like is it though i dyed my hair red no i'm just kidding i always dyed my hair like this reddish color but still just some thoughts okay I might be um, procrastinating from packing. I'm gonna stop now. Okay, so we've made some progress, which is great. What's not so great is that I'm laying on the progress right now. Cause it's cold in San Francisco, so I have to take all these like warm jackets and stuff, but they're all really heavy, so I need to think about what to narrow down. So now I'm gonna try, try on all of these clothes and then narrow them down to the ones that I would really like to take. I'm at the trying stage right now and I'm getting hungry, so I should eat something. Or maybe I should try it on and then eat, I don't know. Hi, it is 4.07 in the morning. I just tried everything I wanted to take and I have put the narrowed options into my luggage. I'm gonna narrow down the options even more, but I'm really glad I, I got myself to do it. Oh my gosh, I feel so accomplished. Also, something really stupid just happened to me. Like, I'm so tired. My period just started, yay. Um. At least it came before the trip, so that's a big thumbs up. I was wearing my heat pack, like this kind. Just put it on, like just. And I went to pee, and I thought it was stuck really well, but it fell inside the toilet. And I'm really upset because that was the only one I had for my back, and now I don't have any more. And um, it's 4 a.m. in the morning. And on that note, I'm gonna go to sleep now. Good night. Hey guys, it's about two days later. So I finally narrowed down all the clothes I wanted to take and we are at the final step. Look at my cute sloth pajamas and cat pajamas. Hey guys. 
Why is it so dark? I have dedicated today to getting a little bit glammed up, getting a fresh set of nails, and I'm also getting a lash lift. I'm gonna end this clip and show you the results after. For my lashes after, um, they were just done um, by tomorrow. They should be a lot more fuller. But yeah, they're super comfortable. I really like it because it's just, it's my natural lashes and then they lift really well and it lasts for about two months, which is amazing. And barely any maintenance and it's just great. Heading to my nail appointment. Obviously, this is the before. So I just got my nails done. I'm really happy. Okay, lashes check, nails check. I am now gonna go home. I need to go and edit this vlog or am I editing another vlog? I don't know. I have so many clips right now that I need to finish editing. Hey guys, good morning. It's like 9 a.m. and we have made it to 42 hours before my flight and that means one and one thing only. It's PCR test time. I'm so not looking forward to this. This is the one thing I was not looking forward to. I can't really function. But yeah, the time has come. I don't know whether to feel excited because I'm boarding my plane in 48 hours or to feel nervous because the feeling of a PCR test is so uncomfortable and it's not even uncomfortable, it's like a unexplainable feeling unless you've done it. So if you've done it, you know what exact you know exactly what I mean. But I really do prefer the home ART kits, which is so crazy that I'm even saying that. But yeah, let's go do it. Guys, oh my god, oh my god, I did it, I'm done. Oh my god, we're done, we're done. I was I put my earphones in because okay, you know what? Let me take you through what happened. So I couldn't film it because, you know, it was just, just an awkward situation. I wasn't going to be like, hey, one second, let me put my camera down, you know. Um, is there like a weird glare on me right now? I'm sorry. It was actually so much more quicker than the last time I got it on. One second, I need to sneeze. Went to the clinic, did the whole registration and everything. Sat down. I was like, ah, because I've done this before. So I, so I know that it takes a little bit of time, like while they're in your nose. So I was like, okay, one second, let me put my music on. So I put my music on. She's like, it's okay, you just breathe. And I was like, okay, from where? Like my, you know, you're going up my nose right now. I was like, okay, and then I played like a song. And then she went, doo -doo 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 -doo, and it was done. That's not a proper reenactment, but it was really quick. It was so quick, it was so much more quicker. That's why I'm so chirpy right now. I'm not sneezing that much. It was so efficiently quick that you felt the uncomfortableness, but not for too long that it felt painful. So that was good. So I'm, oh my God, I'm just so excited. I actually finally got my PCR test done, which means now we are on the brighter side of things, which means by the time I get my results, I'm going to be flying out in about 24 hours. I should be getting my results by tomorrow. And also, I got a new AirPods case. It's a purple case because I didn't want my white ones to get dirty. So I'm gonna put that on right now. Oh, why is it like peeling from inside? Cute little case I got online for like six dollars. Ta-da! Cute. And then you get a little keychain with it as well. Hi guys, so I just got an email on my phone that I can online check in now, which is intense because that means I'm literally like leaving in two minutes. Okay, no it doesn't, but that means I'm like this close to actually departing and that means I'm this much closer to going to the airport. I've like, I'm about to travel, like holy shit, dude. Like, oh my God. I have been so stressed lately because of everything going on and all the deadlines I need to meet before I travel and like go. But the fact that I now got the notification from Singapore Airlines that I can now online check in is like, it hits harder that dude, you're like literally going in like two minutes, you know? So I just did that. Um, I just online checked in and while I was doing it, like, you know that TikTok, my heart's going pitter patter, pitter patter. My heart's going pitter patter, pitter patter. I feel sick like I was actually feeling that. My heart was actually like, dog, 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 you know, like in like a good way. But just that feeling you're like, oh my God, did I leave something at home? Or like, did I not pack something? Or like, did I not do something I'm supposed to do? Feelings are just, I don't know what it's going to be like. I know what, it, and I remember what it's like to be at the airport, obviously, but like, I don't know what it's going to be like during COVID times, like everyone's gonna be wearing a mask and social distancing. And like, as I online checked in, the requirements and stuff are a little bit different. So I did not get my boarding pass because I still need to go to the airport and figure out a few documentations, which I think everyone needs to do, but I'm not sure on that. And that, I'm totally looking forward to it. I don't know if you guys are looking forward to it, but like, oh my God, I don't know what to even say. Hey guys, I'm at the airport. Can you believe that? I can't. I'm literally here. This is the... Where is it? Departure. What? No way I'm here. I'm saying I'm with my family. We're saying our goodbyes. 
Well, no one's really saying anything right now, but yeah, we're here. Currently in the washroom because I wore a different set of clothes. I'm gonna change it. I have changed. I've got some leggings, vans, jacket. Let's go. Really cloudy outside. Oh my god, we're landing in six minutes. <laughs> 